Hey, welcome to the video. So if you're here, then you're probably just as curious as I am when it comes to asking random Helldivers for their gear. But let me explain where I got this idea from. So originally, I was working on a different idea for a video to see how viable it would be to jump in without a backpack slot or support weapon and just bring in, you know, straight utility, firepower, whatnot. And for the most part, I generally didn't have an issue. I was usually able to find some sort of weapon on the ground, or maybe I could find something that was dropped by an ally that had already passed away, or maybe someone who left the game. But at some point during my recording of all this, I had noticed that very often my teammates would have their support weapon or even their backpack slot already off a of cooldown and they were still currently alive and holding what they had and well just to be honest with y'all i just straight up started asking people that's just it i would just ask people straight up if i could borrow or bum a gun or a backpack slot just to see if they would actually a respond and b if they'd even be willing to share with me before I show you how these actually played out, I want to explain how I recorded my data for this. So I recorded my findings over the course of 24 different missions. Why 24? Because honestly, this started taking way too long and I needed to move on to something else. I split it up evenly between the bots and the bugs with 12 missions each. So this includes 40 minute missions as well as blitz missions. Basically split it down into three different categories. How often they said yes, how often I was ignored because funnily enough that actually ended up happening a few times and then how often I actually got told no outright. All right, now to move on to the data. So out of 24 total games where I asked for a weapon or a backpack slot, I can happily say that 19 times it was a yes. Uh, people had no problem dropping me stuff. It, and in even better news, no one ever told me no straight up anytime I asked. Now you might be wondering, I only said I got answered yes 19 times out of 24 games. What happened to the other five times? Well, to be honest, I just got straight up ignored. Now, during this, I would only ever ask through text chat. I never had voice comms on just on the off chance that someone might have it disabled by default. But even still, yeah, five games where I just straight up got ignored and I never got an answer back. So you know what? That is what it is. Maybe they were just focused on the game. I'm, I'm not really going to blame them on it. I, there are some things that I miss in the chat as well. But I got to say, though, like it, it led to some of the most fun games I have had in this game so far. And again, this is with complete strangers. I didn't do this with any friends. I wanted to go into quick play and just host games. And honestly, I think this is the way maybe teams should be moving forward. Not everyone needs to bring a backpack slot. Not everyone needs to bring a support weapon. I think having one or two people coming in with just four full stratagems actually loaded up, ready to go, that brings a lot of firepower, any more than any support weapon can bring, and a lot of versatility and utility when what you can bring. Like I tested out just burning in nothing but eagles or like a mix of orbitals with sentries. Like I brought a little bit of everything in and I started noticing that my teammates were doing the same and we were just all sharing things. There was even a point where the, all four of us had a supply bag, so we were just loaded up with ammo for the whole game. And one thing I always see people complain on Reddit in regards to support weapons with backpack slots is how it's unrealistic to expect people to reload for you and vice versa. Well, I think maybe if you just drop your backpack, drop your weapon when you have it off a of cooldown, ping it to someone who may have a free back slot, see if they pick it up, be willing to share, or maybe you drop them the full, you know, give them the full kit. Give them the auto cannon with the backpack, you guys can take turns. I started doing this with randoms online and it worked out fairly well. Most of my games ended a success running like this. Oh, and in case I didn't mention this at the very beginning, this was all done on Helldive. But that really isn't the point of this video. I'm not here to tell you how you should metagame or to change up your complete loadout or how your teams are working or even that having a support weapon or backpack slot is bad. No, that's, that's not the point of this. I really just wanted to go in and just see how well, you know, the community was with sharing their weapons and gear, like I said at the very beginning and i'm very happy to find out that this community surprises me in more ways than one but i will go ahead and throw this in here in that i am working on a couple of compositions with teams with my friends in regards to maybe having two people not coming with the support slot filled in or even like a backpack slot so you'll see that here soon coming from me but for now i'll leave you with this if you notice that a fellow homie doesn't have a support weapon or a backpack slot and you have something off of cooldown maybe be willing to drop it and share the more the merrier right well that's really all i got Thank you for watching. Y'all have a good one.